Hello, this is Max with Avon Website Pro, and this particular video is on Google Analytics. And this is, uh, if you want to install analytics, you just uh, you go through the process of grabbing the code through uh, uh, whenever you first sign on for a Google Analytics. And then you're going to come to a, a place that looks like this after you put the code in your website. Okay, so now what we have here is this is our sessions, and this is the dates so if you want to change the date of the sessions that you want to you want to view you can see on this particular website we had just installed uh, analytics yesterday and we can see you know this is a new site so we're tracking the uh, the the segments of it okay so over here uh, you have your dashboard and stuff like that and you can modify your dashboard I'm not going to get into all that but as is uh, real time is right here. That means what's currently going on in your website. You can see that there's zero on there right now. I'll go to this website and I'll uh, bring it up in a browser. And whenever I bring it up in the browser, you should see. Then there you go. There's there's uh, one visitor on there right now. So you can see that. Uh, that it came on there. Now as I tour these pages right now you can see when it's just a slash like that that means they're on the home page. Now let me go to like a page it's called promotions. Okay and uh, you should see here in a second or two because there's there's a slight delay by the time the report gets back to the analytics uh, you should see, this should come up and say promotions and it does. If you scroll down here a little bit further you can see what area of the country that they're coming from. Now if you want this to be, um, uh, you know, if you want to see what particular city that, that they're coming from, just click on locations, just like that. And then whenever United States is highlighted, just click on United States. Okay, and now you can see the city, and that's Boardman, Ohio. So, okay, so that's that's what you could do. And now this this right here is the traffic sources. This means where are they coming from? Is there another website linking to you? and we can see here that it's direct so I went into there and I put the direct website right into the browser right here's the content that's being viewed okay um, here's the an event list that there's no data because uh, you know that has to do with um, you know w what's going on within uh, the website as far as you know conversions and stuff like that alright so that's real time okay now if you want to get out of real time and you want to see the the um, you know just the history you know maybe you ran a Facebook campaign last week or yesterday and you want to see what it did or uh, you know a Google AdWords campaign you just click on overview here and then here you could see how many visits came you know yesterday now this is today and it's still going on um, so we can see we have four four sessions two users you know uh, they they paged around for about two and a half pages. Here's the average session. They were on there for eight minutes and 22 seconds, and so on and so forth. Okay. Now, if we go down here, we can look and we can see that there's you know uh, d the demographics as far as country language, but here we could see you know what operating systems they're using. You know uh, as far as uh, desktops, and here's mobile down here. So you just click on this, and we can see that it's a Windows system. Okay, if we want to see about the mobile operating systems, we can see that there's no data for this. Okay, because there's nobody viewing it on a mobile operating system. Now, if we look at the service provider, we could see that Armstrong Cable Services, there was four sh sessions, and then uh, Selco Partnership, DBA Verizon Wireless, you know, 20% came from there. Okay, so that's how you, you kind of look and you can analyze what's going on and where these people are coming from. Now, one of the most uh, important things that uh, I like is this conversions or this behavior. Because if I go down here to site content and I click on all pages, this is going to tell me what pages people are visiting the most. So I know that, you know, this products, Flatware Creations Dash 2, you know, it's getting more visits than these other pages. So maybe I want to do a little bit more promoting on that page and, and direct people through to these other pages. Okay. Uh, here's uh, your landing pages. Okay, now as we can see, most people when they come right now, they're uh, it's they come to the, either the home page or the Flatware Creations too. Okay, 
So, and then the people, when they bounce off or exit the page, we can see that, you know, that's where most people are exiting the page too. Okay, so this is just a little basic overview on how to uh, read your Google Analytics and find out what platforms they're using, where they're coming from, what pages they're visiting, how long they're staying here, and then uh, date adjustment. Of course, this is a brand new website, so you're not going to see too many visits right now. But as you uh, continue on and, and uh, uh, promoting the site, you're going to see uh, increases as long as you're dedicated to it. Okay, this is Max with Avon Website Pro. I hope this was uh, beneficial for somebody.